Day 10 on the escape from the back garden. He's digging a trench. So we've roughly marked out the area where the uh, trench is going to go. So we've got a an orange line down there. And then an orange line all the way along there and then an orange line down to there. The reason I haven't put an orange line from there to there yet is because we need to keep walking past with the barrow. Come on get working, what you stop for? Do you know, you've got to bloody keep telling these youngs to bloody work. Put your back into it. I don't know, he's half bloody naked. I'm freezing, I've got three jumpers on. Anyway. So, I know you're supposed to have profile boards and stuff like that and whatever. But what I wanted to do was, I wanted to just get a rough idea of where we're digging and the trench width. And so forth. So hopefully by the end of today we might end up with like a little island where the uh, wheelbarrow is. Um, obviously we're not, we won't get down the full depth today, that's just ridiculous because it's rock hard as this soil. But if we can get a couple of feet down all the way around the three edges I'll be well happy. So uh, that's it. So I'll give you an update in a minute. Come on, what are you resting for? Get your bloody back into it. So, believe it or not, we've done this bit here and then round there. And that's taken us about how long? Bloody four hours. Because it's just solid clay and rocks and all sorts. And down there, there must be, and I'm not joking now, about 40 barrel loads of muck. So, but you can see the basic shape where the uh, foundations are going to go. So, you know, I think we're doing a right good job. Whether we're doing it right or wrong, no idea. But at the end of the day, all we're doing is digging a trench um, and the critical thing will be when we come to start building and stuff like that so we'll have to wait and see but uh, hi. hiya, you alright? there you are there Zach's heard a bit of pussy so his eyes are popping out of his head Anyway, so what are you doing? I had muck in my cup, so I had, huh? it out. I had muck in it, so I had to squeeze it out. Jesus. Anyway, I will get back to you when uh, Zach's dug down there. Ha ha ha! Nearly there. Are you joking? Right, anyway, we are now still digging, the pile is getting bigger and the rocks are getting bigger as well and the blisters on my hand are getting bigger. So, 
we've hit some hard stuff and as you can see we're probably only about two foot down so it is really really hard work but we're getting there so what I'm going to probably do is this stuff is rock hard I might just level that off and then that'll, do, that'll be the, the base for the foundations for the back and then as we get down here onto this soft stuff then step down and go down to the proper depth because that stuff is absolutely really rock hard well as you can see look, look at the size of them bloody bricks stone we've pulled out compared to my foot uh, and I'm a size 9 and massive so anyway hiya you alright? we are getting closer my blisters are getting bigger Mr Pusser is getting more knackered so um, we're going to dig from there to this, the edge of this flagstone here basically uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to leave that for now and then we're going to concentrate on this side now so we're going to dig from there down to there down to here now and then what we're going to do is that back stuff that back channel because it's rock hard and there's massive lumps of rock in there and stuff like that we're going to level that off and then we're going to have a step because um, this stuff's a lot easier to dig so this will dig a lot deeper with this one and then we'll have a step on that back thing so what I'll do is I'll do another video when we've dug, dug this out and then you'll sort of like get the gist then bye yeah so we're still doing loads more work and my son's up here working his what the fuck are you doing sat down again Jesus right anyway so we're getting there we're digging away nice and slowly as you can see it's taking shape now the reason I've put them flags on is because when we were stepping getting in and out of the trench we were sort of like standing on the edge of it and it was collapsing and um, I figured that we need somewhere to put the cement mixer when we're mixing the concrete I think that'll be easier if we just do it there so that's the reason why those are there so they just we've just laid them down and that's it so they're not very level in fact I hope that when I build the shed it's a bit more level than that but anyway so I'll tell you what I have done I've totally underestimated how much soil was going to get dug out fucking loads of it man oh and I've underestimated the bricks you know the big boulders as well so, and the other reason I'm picking these flags up is because they need picking up anyway. Uh, these three here, the reason why I've left them is because the front, the door to my shed is going to be about where that green twig is, or a bit back. And when I come out of the door, I want to land on, like, you know, a couple of rows of flags. So... So I think the next thing to do is, I don't think we're going to dig this trench across here just yet. We're going to wait till last for that. Um, so what we're going to do now is dig a bit more down there. Sort of like a, a, the next level, if you know what I mean. And same with that side. So I shall uh, be back shortly. Right. 
calling it to do for today. I'm knackered. So, we're getting a bit further. Can't really see how the sun's. So, we've stepped it down a bit there because that raised bit is absolutely solid. It's rock solid, so we've gone down a bit. And then, uh, gone down there as well. But we've also found in that corner, I don't know if you can see it, that hole, it's a square hole. Yeah, go on Zach, stick that, it goes down quite a way. So there's been some sort of post there, but nothing surprises me with all the crap we found in while digging this. But anyway, so. I think we've done well today. So that's it, that's the video for today, over and done with. The muck pile's getting bigger. Alright guys, it's going to be next weekend before I do any more I think. Because tomorrow I'm off on my motorbike. So we'll uh, see you later.